The Next Cycle, Season 20, Episode 5. Henry. Are you okay? Hi, George. No, man. I'm not. I've really messed up with Casey. It's okay the worst of your and her problems are out of the way. It's more between me and her over our mum dying. I'm sorry for your loss by the way. I know Rosie and Fade are still a bit upset over it. I swear none of us knew about it. Casey said nothing. It's not exactly fine. But it's certainly not your fault. There's only one person I blame for this. Can I ask you something? Sure, anything. Do you think there's a chance for me and Casey to get back together again? I honestly don't know. I hope there's a chance for you guys. Mainly so she can move out soon as. I don't really want her at my place. But I can't exactly turn my own sister down. If you want her back, you will have to fight for it Henry. I know. I don't know if this is okay with you. But what if you have the wake here after the funeral? Yeah that would be great. Thanks Henry. At least Casey will know that I still care. And that will give me a chance at least. You messed up. You're only human. Anyway. I did come in here for a cup of tea and a scone. So if you could get right to that, that would be great. I've left your fate alone to run the shop for a bit. Hello? George? Jade? Anyone here? It's me, Alicia. I need some assistance. Oh fuck. Hang on, Alicia. I'll be out in a jiffy. Hi, Alicia. What were you doing back there, Jade? I was just trying on our new range of old women's clothing. Right, okay. Anyway. How can I help you? Since I'm in college now and just about to go into my second year. I need a chef's outfit. I was wondering if you have anything. Well we don't sell chef's hats. But we do sell nice white shirts and smart chef like trousers. And there are shoes over there. Try whatever you want on. Great. Thank you. Oh dad. That's disgusting. All I ever see you do nowadays is drink. Look at the state of you. Where is your self-respect? Ava. I deserve to have a good fucking drink. I have lived a crap life surrounded by crap people. Thanks a lot. I'm not hanging around here. Enjoy your drunk afternoon. You look like you've had enough of it all. I know how that feels. Ava. Honestly. I need a break from all this. I really do. What do you mean? You were going to break up with my dad? No Daisy. You can't. You can't just leave it to me. I'm sorry Ava. I've tried to put up with it for so long. I can't be here anymore. Neither can Alicia. I have to look out for our best interests. Your dad, he needs help. To get himself off the drink. And he has more respect for you rather than me. You are his daughter. So what does this mean? What are you going to do? It means that Alicia and I will be going back to George's flat above the clothes store. Henry, are you okay? Not really. I need my family back together. I miss it so much. My dad has dementia and I cheated on Casey. And I don't really know why I'm telling you all this. You can talk to me about anything Henry. I'm not here for an argument or to cause trouble. I want to know if there's anything I can do. I can't ask you for help. It's not appropriate. Well if you tell me what it is then maybe I can help you. Casey's mum has died recently. And I said to her brother that I would hold the wake here. To try and make amends with Casey. But I have so much to sort. There's food, drinks, having the right amount of staff, making sure Casey and George both like it. Okay, just calm. I will help you get this organized. 
but on one condition. After this, we are cool. Hey mom. Don't chat. Help me out with these bags. And turn to go inside. What why? We are moving back in with George. To our old home. So come on.